All right. Hi, everybody. I'm going to walk you through how to set up the Rode Reporter mic today if you need it for your broadcast project or any other project. If you get the Reporter mic from us, it's going to come in this awesome case that keeps it nice and safe. First thing to do when you get it, open it up. Check it out. We'll have it nicely organized for you. In here, you'll have the mic. You'll have your mic flag that you have to put on to represent GNHS TV. You'll also have some extra batteries, the transmitter, some cables, depending on which device you're connecting it to, and also, most importantly, the receiver, okay? So in a second, all this will be out of the box, and I'll show you how to get this set up on your phone for this one. We are looking at everything kind of spread out now. And so the only added addition outside of the box is the camera rig. So I'm gonna show you how, where you should probably attach things on there. Okay, so let's get started. Most importantly, we gotta represent GNHS TV. So we're gonna put our mic flag on. You wanna make sure it's gonna look nice and even. Just give it a little adjustment if you need to. Go ahead and set that back down. All right, next thing is we have the transmitter. Now, as you can see, this is gonna plug into the bottom of the microphone. And it has this little clip here, so you wanna make sure that you stick it in far enough that you go past that, because as you tighten it, it actually releases that clip to lock it in place. So the way to test it is tighten it as much as you possibly can, and if you can, can't pull it out, then you are good, all right? Don't touch this for a little bit. Now, with your rig over here, remember these are the cold shoes at the top. At the bottom of the receiver, you have a little kind of slide to get in there. So if you're gonna have a light on top of your rig, maybe put on the side one. If you Otherwise, you can just put it right in the middle and go ahead and tighten that down. All right, get that tightened down. And we wanna make sure it's nice and secure we don't want it going anywhere. It really doesn't matter which direction it points, but you probably want to be able to see the screen here for when you turn it on so you can see if levels are coming through. All right, that's done. Set that aside. And then we also have our different kinds of cords, okay? So I want to go over these really quickly. This is the one that came with the Rode Reporter set, but it is very similar to ones we have. So I'll just walk you through the ones you're probably going to see um, that you get from us. If you see, you have a black and a gray. This is great for your iPhone. Whether it's an iPhone with a headphone jack or whether you need the dongle, you want the gray one, okay? So the black side goes into the transmitter, I'm sorry, the receiver, and the gray one goes into your iPhone, okay? Now the way you can tell that, and this is kind of goofy and silly, and I don't quite understand why, but you'll notice there's two rings and three rings, okay? Two rings are great for regular stereo stuff and also Android, while for some reason, Apple likes the three rings. If you have an Android phone, you're gonna use something like our normal red road cord, and that has the two rings on both sides, okay? So then, go ahead and get ready for your phone. So you go ahead and plug this into the side of the transmitter, okay? Remember, the gray is gonna go into your iPhone. Now, most of us are gonna need a dongle, so go ahead and plug the dongle in. I'm gonna get some of this extra stuff out of here that we don't need right now, all right? And technically, we're good to go. Now, if you wanna make sure that things are working and it's set up, just go ahead and hold down the power button on the receiver, okay? That'll turn on. You'll notice it's automatically gonna be looking for it. RX means the receiver, and that gives you your battery levels, okay? On the microphone, you'll see the slide door. If it's not open, go ahead and open it. Hold down the power button. And now you'll notice that they're both hooked up. So it says RX and TX, receiver, transmitter. And I'm gonna go ahead and hold the mic to my mouth and talk, and whoa, we have some levels, okay? So that's a good thing. So now let's talk about how to put your phone in here and check some of that out. All right, now that we have our phone in here, let's make sure that we're good to go. Now, I found this awesome app the other day called Decibel Meters. There's a ton of them on and available on the App Store. Now, right now, it's reading its normal internal mics. You'll see that it's going kind of crazy. But to see that it's catching this external mic, the second I plug it in, it should 
drop down. And look, there it did. All right, so it's picking up some stuff. Actually, it's picking up the fact that I have this microphone on. So if I shut off the receiver, it drops to almost zero. And it actually is going back and forth between that and the external. Okay, so I'm gonna turn the receiver back on. All right, now I've talked before about how to make sure our mics are set up right. All right. So in order to make sure that the mic is working, go ahead and hold the mic to your face and talk a little bit. And if we start to push it, pull it farther away from your mouth and talk at the same level, you'll notice it goes down. Talking again closer to the mic, you'll see it spikes. Now you're ready to go. You know that when you record a movie, you're gonna be good. So jump on over to your camera and go ahead and get it situated inside and you should be good to go all right happy reporting everybody hope this works